Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 5. My name is Daniel, also known as Witch Hats, and in the last episode, Kanashiro confessed to the police. We didn't get to hear what he said. Don't know how remorseful he actually is. I mean, we did change his heart, so probably a little bit. Um, but, uh, yeah, that, that whole chapter of the Phantom Thieves is over and done with. So for now, until we have another target, we are going to lay low and just do, uh, do calm stuff. And also go, probably go to Mementos soon. Um, because that's a thing we haven't done in a while. Um, so in the meantime, oh. let's call Kawakami. All right, hi, this is Becky. Oh, wait, it's you. It's summer. Oh, wait, hold on. I don't think... I think this is new. Wait, is this considered playing at night? Or worse? Well, it's under my supervision. It's fine. Does your room need cleaning, or did you need me to cook for you? I provide all sorts of services. But, um, there's stuff I need to talk to you about, so would you request me? That's why I called. Hey. Yep, I don't care how much it costs. I have all of the money, and that is not true. But, well, no, it can't be true for a while. Um, I'll, be heading, I'll be heading over right away. Hey, hey! I actually really like the antique feel of this room. But I have to say goodbye to it today. Um... The thing is, I've decided to quit. My boss found me a part-time job that pays better than this one. Takasekun's guardians keep increasing their demands. So, this is just what I have to do. Is this really what you want? What I want. Takasekun's guardians say the only true way to apologize to Takasekun is by paying them. If that's not true, then what's the right thing to do here? I wonder if I can escape all this if I quit being a teacher. People like me have no right being a teacher. If I quit on my own, I won't have to pay them. That's why I'm going to quit both my teaching job and my maid job. What do you think? Well, if that's what you decided. That's what I decided. But did I really decide it on my own? Now that I think about it, it's too late for me to stop being a teacher. If I really felt bad for what happened, I would have resigned the day he died. And yet, I still feel the need to teach. I wonder why I feel that way even now. It doesn't really matter what we say here, so, uh... Try to remember. Crucican. Oh, that's right. I decided the way to apologize to him was to make sure there won't ever be another student like him. Because I might have been able to save him if I hadn't been afraid of rumors or labels back then. I wanted to become a teacher who takes care of her students. That's the mindset I had. But now, I spend all my free time at part-time jobs, just so I can continue working as a teacher. I put the critical work of a teacher on the back burner so I could make apology money. That's where it all went wrong. I can't make things right with Takase-kun like this. Once again, it doesn't really matter what, uh, what we say here, but I feel like mistakes can be fixed. I'll be the teacher I aspire to be. That's the right way for me to make amends to Takase-kun. From here on, I refuse to pay them any more money. And that is my answer. Well, what do you think? I think that's the right choice, and this does matter, actually. So. This is the right choice, and that's the right choice. You can get the right answer from someone else. You can't get the right answer from someone else. It can only be found from within. I learned that from you. In a way, you're my teacher. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. I feel Kawakami's trust in me strengthening. There we go. All right. Your temperance confidant has increased to rank eight. You will now earn more EXP from Arcana Burst when fusing personas of the Temperance Arcana. 
I've been so worried about making money that I haven't been paying attention to my students. Especially to you. I averted my eyes from you because you were labeled, just like Takase-kun was. But from now on, I'm going to protect you too. As your teacher, I will never betray you. That's reassuring. Leave it to me. I can be decisive when it counts. I'll speak with the Takases. I'm not going to run anymore. Everything should be fine as long as I talk to them face to face. Alright, it's time for me to go. Thanks. Thank you. I'll see you later. Good night. Good night. Aw, oh, man. I don't even know what I was doing. I was just sleeping. Don't be ridiculous. This new ally you gained was Makoto? Wait, why did I say that? Just tell me the truth. Why did I say that? Ah, uh, you already know the truth. Makoto. That's preposterous. If what you say is true, was Makoto also running from the police when you were arrested? Uh, absolutely not. It was just me. Now that I think about it, she did start talking a lot about the investigation from summer onward. <sighs> Makoto aside, you mentioned one other important detail. Did Kanashiro really say there was someone using the metaverse besides the Phantom Thieves? That's what he said. Those words could just be taken as you shifting blame to this other person, you know. Oh, probably. But, uh... Take it how you will. <laughs> but why would you fabricate such an elaborate story and then shift the blame elsewhere? There are two possibilities. Either you've simply been trying to confuse me with your lies, or everything you've stated is true. Have you been telling me the truth from the very start? Of course. Does that mean you're placing your trust in me? Well, it's pretty much the only option I have left because, I mean, I'm captured. <sighs> then again, I am investigating a thief who steals hearts. Very well. No matter how absurd it may seem, I'll reevaluate my stance on believing you, for now. In return, speak the whole truth and nothing but the truth. It's a fair deal. Is that acceptable? Oh man, a deal. You know what that means. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that break it thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the judgment persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Judgment rank one. All right. You've unlocked the judgment confidant. We're running out of time. Let's move on to your next target. I stand corrected. It was they who targeted your group first, wasn't it? The identity of your opponent is this. Medjed, that sounds familiar. We have no pictures. Even their names and identities are unknown. If what you told me is true, then this nav thing you've mentioned wouldn't have worked in this case. How did you target them? Tell me everything. Well, see, the thing is, we kind of, uh... Uh... I don't remember what we did. I'm drugged. The summary of this po story up to this point has been updated. To read, press the triangle button. Also note, when we unlocked the... Uh... When we unlocked the Judgment Arcana, we did not get the whole Arcana Burst thing. And that's because that's technically how... Because this is, remember, a flashback. And uh, the Phantom Thieves have made, made him have a change of heart, right? Seriously, the Phantom Thieves are amazing. Isn't it so cool how they steal people's hearts? How do they make them repent? I'm really curious. Who are they? Oh man, it looks like people are talking about us. 
But uh, notice that, once again, the interrogation with Sai is, uh, is happening in the future. So, it makes sense that we wouldn't get the benefits of that social, even though we technically unlocked it. And like, uh, hey, could you come downstairs? Sorry, I was, uh, I wanted to not stay on one screen for too long. Oh man, Check the ingredients serious. in the fridge. Will do. Hey, what's up? Huh? It's not right? Not cute. That was the one the staff recommended to me, though. Won't that printer do? Huh? It'll do, but it's not it. Okay, I'll be right over. <sighs> this might take a while. I'm leaving the store to you. Sounds good. For me if I don't come back. Uh, got it. I owe you one. <laughs> what a handful. And that concludes the latest news on the suspect Kaneshiro. This case is said to be a result of the Phantom Thieves' actions, but what do you think? We don't know their methods, but I believe they are a menace that will threaten this law-abiding country. Yes, how dare they stop criminals. They're clearly going to threaten this law-abiding country by stopping all those criminals and changing all their hearts. Like, how can people hide things in the shadows and get away with shady shit if we have a bunch of, like, altruistic teenagers running around changing people's hearts? How dare they? This dangerous group tampers with people's hearts. It's no different from brainwashing. I see. You're absolutely correct. I wonder what's going on. Didn't this happen a little while ago, too? Who was it again? You know, that famous artist. His name was Madarame. Ah, uh, Madarame, was it? Oh, hey, he remembered. They punished those awful people, didn't they? The Phantom Thieves aren't at fault, then. I like this old lady. Well, that may be true, but... Here, old lady, have another coffee on the house. Uh, don't ask me why. Don't you think so too, dearie? The Phantom Thieves aren't doing anything wrong, are they? Of course they're not. See, even he says that they're doing good. Oh my, look at the time. We should probably head home. Alright. Ah, you're right. Wait, didn't I just wake up? Thanks for the drink. If I just woke up, then... What? How is it that late? Yes. I've received the reports on Kaneshiro's case. But to think the Phantom Thieves would honestly attempt an absurd idea like social reform. Uh, you're absolutely right. I'm not pleased about the general public support of them either. There's also the danger of the Metaverse being exposed with their continued actions. Oh man. He knows about the metaverse. And we know Actually, there is one countermeasure he brought in that seems usable. No, you know. He knows about the metaverse, and there's someone around running around in the metaverse like doing bad things. And if you remember at the beginning of the uh, game, um at the beginning of the game he profited directly from one of the mental shutdowns. Um, it was a, it, it's, it's very short and it's very brief and I didn't even notice it until like doing this Let's Play and I wasn't gonna mention it right at the time because um, I don't want to give too much away. But um, at the beginning of the Let's Play, if you go back and watch like the first bit, um, they they have the whole train wreck and he go and he's saying like um, that train wreck brought to light like a bunch of problems with the rail like the 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 industry was hiding that the rails were uh, were not being maintained properly and all this other stuff and he profited directly from that like by being like hey look at look at all the stuff that you haven't done this is why the accident happened but it was really caused by the mental shutdown uh, or the psychotic breakdown i'm not sure which one they it technically was but um they kind of use that interchangeably but we only ever see one thing happening and that was the thing that was happening to the conductor so i wonder what exactly uh like so it definitely seems like he's and he's like it's pretty obvious that he's tied to this 
directly. It involves having the Phantom Thieves destroy themselves without our direct intervention. We'll set things up so that those mental shutdown occurrences are their doing. Oh man. Ah, I thought as much. I had a feeling that it was too brutal for it to be his own idea. Still, to think you'd go through such elaborate detail to crush them. Their actions must be that much of an eyesore for you. I sympathize with what you're going through. Well then, I'll clean this up quickly and put it behind us. Yes, a grand undertaking like social reform is beyond a group such as the Phantom Thieves. Only a few people are entitled to change the world, like you, future Prime Minister. <laughs> oh man, it's Ryuji. Hey, it's me. Where you at? What you doing? Uh, watching the store. Gotcha. We're gonna come over right now about the uh, you know what. See ya. The uh. The what? What's up? We're here to hang out. That's not why we're here. We need to study for finals. Oh, right. Studying. Why am I here, too? You're one of us now, so of course you gotta help us. We're in trouble if you don't teach us, you know? Uh... Well... I don't... I don't... I don't want to not study, but... I don't think that Ryuji's right about it being on Makoto to teach us all, so I'm just gonna be like, I don't need to study, I'm good. I got this. Oh, I'll hold you to that. Wanna see you get to the higher test scores? Ryuji, are you really challenging me on that? Let's leave those guys be. <sighs> I couldn't ask the last time I was here, but what is this place? The storekeeper doesn't seem to be around. Hey, I am the storekeeper now. He left me in charge. I'm the boss. That's where this guy lives. He's got complicated circumstances. Oh yeah, you don't know the whole story. We can tell her about it, right? Actually, tell yourself. Okay, so I punched this dude, right? Well, I didn't actually punch him. I just kind of grabbed his shoulder. That's... that's terrible. I know, right? On Yusuke and me are pretty much the same, too. I mean, <laughs> it's not as bad as this guy's, though. It's just something we can't ever put up with. That's why we all became Phantom Thieves. Hey, don't forget me. I know, I know. We're all part of the team. By the way, Makoto, ain't there someone you can't forgive either? Like, a heart you want to change? That's a secret. Ah, oh, there's someone like that. You could just tell us, you know. You don't gotta be so cold. That aside, do you have any intention of studying for the exam? I do. Not really. It's fine if I leave then? No, no, I'm just joking. Please teach us. Hmm. What was this term? It's phobia, so it's a fear of some kind. I think it's a fear of open spaces. You don't hear it that often, though. Leave vocabulary and long sentences to me. I suck at proper grammar, though. Ugh, even if we study English, it's not like I'm gonna use it in the future. Yeah, I'm sure. When it comes to you, your Japanese is questionable, too. Uh, shut up! <laughs> I'm, I'm sure that was, like, translated, like... I, I'm, I'm I'm sure the original for that was like. Explain the writer's feelings. Even more hilarious. What point is there in that? Oh, it's impossible. I can't memorize all these formulas. Ain't there a good way of cheating? Yeah. See, what you do, Ryuji, is you you have to write them down somewhere, but you can't write them on your body because that's too obvious. So what you do is you just read them over and over again, and then they'll imprint in your brain. Oh wait, that's memorization. Why don't we take a break? And that was the follow-up report on the suspect Kaneshiro. Now, Akechi-san. Oh, this'll be good. 
This case is said to be the result of the Phantom Thieves' actions, but in actuality, is this true? Considering how a calling card was scattered about, I believe there's no mistaking that. The question is what the Phantom Thieves actually did. If they tampered with the suspect's heart, it casts doubt on the authenticity of any confession. So then, by tampering with hearts, the Phantom Thieves are fabricating crimes that may not exist? We can't deny the possibility. There's no doubt that the Phantom Thieves are exposing hidden injustices in society. However, if this is done by sidestepping the law, their way of thinking is very dangerous. So, in a way, they're outlaws? Yes. They're no different than the criminals they target. This cannot be overlooked. I see. Oh, I see. My ass! Why the hell are we being treated as the bad guys? Just let them say whatever they want. More people are starting to understand that what we're doing is right, after all. When I'm walking around in town, I hear a lot more people talking about us, too. And the forum's been full of hype. Do you think we made it big time? Don't get pompous over dealing with some street thug. Save it for after we deal with a bigger target. We just gotta take down a bigger one, yeah? That was the plan from the start anyways. True. It may be best if we start thinking about it. I bet we'll find one in no time. Wind's blowing in our direction and everything. I feel like we won't lose to anything right now. Well, we'll decide on that eventually. We need to overcome our exams first. Now then, break time's over. Let's get back to... That reminds me, the celebration party. Weren't we gonna do it after exams? Yes, I believe so. Where should we go? I feel like I'll study better if I got something to look forward to. The last one was a buffet at a hotel. We haven't gone anywhere since. Hmm? A buffet? Where would be good? Hey, what about fireworks? A fireworks festival! Oh yeah, it's that season, huh? <laughs> that sounds good to me. It's hard to ignore a buffet, but I'll take the beauties of summer. Still, I demand that we feast during the festival as well. Do you guys own a yukata? Will you wear a yukata? Doesn't a fireworks festival sound good? You think so too, right? Heck yeah, man. It's a great idea. Alright, fireworks festival it is. Let's look for a good one. Study comes first, though. I won't let you off if you fail any of them. Are we clear? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> uh. oh. Alright, fireworks festival it is. Let's look for a good one. Someone's spying on us, huh? Study comes first, though. I won't let you off if you fail any of them. Are we clear? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> she had a lot of monitors. Mm. Fire fireworks and yukatas. Guess it's that time of the year. Hey, so there's this dangerous, almost psychotic blog I found that hasn't ended up on the forum yet. <clears throat> I'll kill him. I'll kill him. I'll kill him. That's all it says. Rumor has it she's talking about her boyfriend. Uh, sounds dangerous. Yeah, it seems like she'll do something really bad someday, right? And it gets even worse. As it turns out, she's a Shujin student. You know a girl named uh, Yumeko Mogami? She's always up near the classrooms on the second floor. Please, you have to do something before so things get worse. Oh! <laughs> this is a good opportunity for us. Kanashiro's change of heart has probably opened up some some deeper parts of Mementos. Let's make some time and hang and talk about it at the ha at the hideout. The lovesick cyberstalking girl. I would not call that lovesick or cyberstalking. I would call that uh, murderous. Um, let's see. What 
do we have all of the things? I don't think we have all the... I don't think we have all the things. Um, I was I was going through and checking to see what the mementos uh, missions we have unlocked are, but um, what would that be? Requests, probably. Let's see. So there's that one. There's that one. That one. That one. That one. Yeah, we're missing one. When do we get that one? I hope we get it tomorrow. Because if we don't get it tomorrow, uh, the guy doesn't say anything. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save, and if something went wrong, then I'm going to, uh... Well, I don't know what to do, but, uh, evening. And we probably can't do anything, because we spent all day studying. Well then. Let's call it a day and go to bed. Maybe it happens tomorrow, I don't know. I wonder what the Phantom Thieves' goal is. Are they just choosing bad people to steal hearts from? Maybe someone's asking them to do it. Oh yeah, don't they have a form or something? What if you make a request on there and they follow through? Good morning. What a refreshing morning. How are you doing today? Or how are you today? I didn't expect the Phantom Thieves would suppress a man that even the police had trouble with. The fact that they have so much support online is worrisome. I'm in a bind since I previously denounced them. All the interviews these days ask me about that. Still, can we really say the Phantom Thieves are on the side of justice with just this example? Um, what do you mean? Hey. I was originally investigating the mental shutdown incidents. People cha change suddenly and cause strange accidents or horrible crimes. Don't you think it's similar to do the to the change of heart thing, the phantom the, the change of heart that the phantom thieves are doing? Now that I think about it, their actions mirror the mental shutdown cases with the rate of victims. It's impossible not to see a connection there. Ah, oh, sorry, I don't want to make you late. See you again. <clears throat> so even a catchy is noticing a connection between the what we're doing in the metaverse and whatever that other person's doing in the metaverse. Hmm. It's even more packed than usual today. Now for today's train news. Today's headlines are... Shibu Shibuya, crime ring re Shibuya Crime Ring reveals all. The leader's confession has led to the arrest of other key members. Sudden rampage. Highway accident. The driver's death has been confirmed, taking the total count up to four. Hot spots of Tokyo. Come see the summer, summer fireworks show on July 18th. Thanks to Kaneshiro spilling the beans, that organization is falling like a house of cards. <laughs> We're getting more and more famous. Heck yeah, we are. How tragic. The Phantom Thieves. In this internet society, every silly little thing gets its five minutes of fame. But just like a fleeting firework, they are destined to be forgotten when summer ends. Now that I think about it, there's an, there's an organism that has its own short-lived glimmer. That's right, fireflies. They're probably something akin to magic creatures to you city kids. Crucicun, you haven't been completely tainted by city life yet, so here's a question. Give it a try. What is the name of the light-producing substance in fireflies? The answer to this thing is Luciferin. Well done. Correct. When Luciferin combines with oxygen, it undergoes oxida oxidation and emits light. A firefly cannot cry, so it burns its body, or so they say. Their light is actually a chemical reaction called a cold light. It doesn't produce heat like fire. No hey, did you know that? I had no idea. Stuff about him being smart. Nice Stuff about me getting smart. Knowledge up. Now that I think about it, there's a fireworks show next week. It may be, it may not be a bad idea to go see them. However, don't become so blinded by the far-off lights that you can't see the exams in front of you. Ryuji. Hey, hey. I want to go relax somewhere after exams end. I think we all want to do that, Morgana. 
Karusukun, please come to the student guidance office. I repeat, Karusukun, please come to the student guidance office. Hey! That sounded like Kawakami. I wonder what's up. Sorry. Sorry to pull you out of class, but it's about Takasukun's guardians. I told them that I'm not going to pay them any more money. I'm quitting my part-time job too, although I'm still in a I'm still in talks with my boss about it. I'm gonna devote myself to become a, to being a great teacher, no matter what others say. I won't waver. So thank you for giving me such good advice. I just thought you should be the first to know. Miss Kawakami, you have a guest. The Takases are here. What? They're here? At school? How long are you gonna make us wait? him again? You know it, lady. How rude. I guess the student is only as good as his teacher. Obviously, you lack a proper education. You thought you could just call and say you're not going to pay anymore? Who do you think you are? You know. It's what I decided, for Takase's sake. I'm going to make sure there won't be any more students like him, who... So you're just trying to get out of your responsibility? I bet you don't even care about Taiki. How are you still a teacher? Maybe you re really should sue the Board of Education. Are you okay with that? A teacher who caused his, her student to die would surely cause a scandal. I'm not going to run or hide. I'm going to spend my time taking care of my students. If you want to take legal action, then go ahead. Regardless, I'll continue teaching. I've decided that that's the best apology I can make to, to Kase-san. Paying money to you two is not the solution, to say the least. Hmm. Along with suing you, maybe I should tell everyone about your little secret. You know, about your little stint as a sex worker. What? How did you... Oh, so I'm right, am I? What? I mean, the amount of money you're paying us can't come from just a teacher's salary. Well, shall we head over to the faculty office? Stop, please. Ha! A teacher working in the sex industry? You've definitely done it this time. How unfortunate for you that you thought you could just leave Ta Taiki's matter unsettled. You know what you have to do now, right? Pay up, and don't ever call us again with this garbage about stopping the payments. Haha, <laughs> I guess I can't quit my part-time job just yet. You can't give up. I know, but what am I supposed to do? What about the Phantom Thieves? Would they even help someone like me? No, that's impossible. Haha. <laughs> Kawakami, uh, Kawakami appears to be deeply hurting. I need to do something for Kawakami. I can't do this anymore. What are their names again? Who? The Takases? The husband is Toshio-san, and his wife is Hiromi-san. Haha, <laughs> I could never forget them. I sent them money every week. Wait, why? You don't intend on doing something, do you? Please don't. A Shujin teacher asking the Phantom Thieves for help would be... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was so excited to tell you what I had decided. And then it ended up like this. Just forget everything, okay? If you think about it, I'm right back where I started. I guess I'll never be able to change. Haha. <laughs> Class is about to start. I need to go. <sighs> I need to do something about the targets for Kawakami. There we go. <clears throat> That's it. That's what I was waiting for. <clears throat> so now that we've got that... seven eighteen Marine Day. Finals end on the 16th, so that should be good, right? What are you talking about? The Fireworks Festival. You're really quick to look up stuff like that. Uh, impressive, Ryuji. It's easier to work when you got a goal in mind, yeah? Hey, we're in the middle of class. Talk about these things later. Yeah, yeah. Alright. So we're gonna go make everyone's lives better. Hey. Exams start Wednesday, don't they? Make sure you get some studying in. Alright, but first, before I do studying... Let's go. Well, actually... Fast travel to the hideout. And let's go over 
Let's go over the everything. It appears everyone is here. It is sweltering. The air conditioning seems to have ceased functions entirely. Let's view our requests. Well then, we have some new intel on a Memento's target today. We'll start with this one first. This intel is on an online stalker burning with jealousy because the man she loves has been taken away. It seems she's a, Shuj a Shujin student. Her delusions are really getting out of hand. She's even writing how she's going to kill them. If we don't stop her, she might actually do it. We need to figure something out before that happens. Okay. Fine by me. That's not all. Now on to the next target. Listen up. This intel is on a man who's being abused who's been abusing his girlfriend. The man this man named Uchimura Uchimura has assaulted her countless times. That fortune teller even that fortune teller even predicted she'd be badly hurt if left alone. Those fortunes often often come true. What a jerk. Fortunes aside, we can't let this I love it I love how An An's like, I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh, fortunes aside, we can't let this guy use violence against her. If we don't want her getting hurt, we should change his heart. You can count me in. I agree. It's only natural for us to change the heart of a person like that. Nice. Okay, it looks like we're all ready to do this. We already told Mishima, so the forum post is up and running. That's not all. Now on to the next arc. Listen up. This intel is on the couple related to Kawakami's hor former student. They are quite the foul pair of people. They're using the incident where that child died to try to extort money from Kawakami. <laughs> what? Threatening her is bad enough by itself, but using a deceased child to do it? That's just too much. We have to do this. Mm-hmm. I'll show off my skills in front of Lady On. Nice. Okay, it looks like we're all ready to do this. We already told Mishima, so the forum post is up and running. No objections, yep. right? Hmm. What? We're good to go, if you're okay with it. That's a unanimous decision. Okay, all that's left to do now is take down the target and mementos. Alright, so we got this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, and that's it. So let's go. Time to explore mementos. The number of targets residing within mementos is six at present. Now then, shall we head in? Yes. Let's go. Let us go. Hmm? I can sense some restlessness coming from below us again. Oh yeah, that happened before too, if I'm remembering right, the meta first nav. Yup, we got something. Aw oh, man. We unlocked a new block. A new area has been confirmed in the depths. Updating guidance information. How much bigger is this place gonna get? Yo, Mona, can't you turn into some kind of high-powered radar or something? We'd know how deep it goes if you could. That's impossible. It would be dangerous to wander blindly. We simply do not have enough information. Just driving around won't likely do us any good either. Yeah, but... The path keeps going forward. We'll reach the depths eventually, I think. That again. I'm curious about what might have happened. We should go investigate, Joker. You can quick travel with, within Mementos. Open the map with the R1 button, select Mementos Overview, and choose where you want to go. This can only be done in certain locations, such as the Mementos entrance and the train platforms at the end of each area. Joker! Oh yeah, I have something for you before we head in there. Aw oh man, it's a go home. Times two. Those were the last I had. You're on your own now, okay? The target's really in here, huh? Definitely. I'm sensing them deeper than before, but their presence is certainly here. Alright then, let's go look for them. So let's see here. Uh, well, let's go in. Well, then. Start partway. So we don't need to, we don't need, we can't. Oh yeah, we've never been in here since then. Okay, so we're going to area two. We haven't actually been down any further. Hey, this is where we came last time, right? Yeah, and just as I expected, the path ahead is still open. Alright, time to check it out. So, uh, what I'm gonna do here is, um... Uh, the- well, no, actually, um... I'm just gonna show this all, because it shouldn't take us that long to get there. Um... Alright, we don't know what to expect from here on. We better watch our backs. 
Oh, cautiousness is good, but let's not linger in one area for too long, okay? In Mementos, there's a certain shadow that's far stronger than the rest. We have no chance against it. What? Are you for real? You should have told us that from the start! If you spend too much time in one area of Mementos, a frightening shadow called the Reaper may appear. The Reaper is extremely powerful. Engaging it in battle is not advised. If you hear the sound of change, leave the area chains, leave the area immediately. It's not advisable to fight it, which means at one point or another, not anytime soon, because we're low level, we're gonna be fighting it. That's gonna be fun. But uh that's definitely not today. Actually, I think this is the exact area I fought the Reaper. Yeah, you have to clear out all the Basically, the way the way the Reaper works, I'm pretty sure this is the way it works, is he doesn't appear in an area if there's still shadows in that area. Like, if you haven't explored all of the area, he won't appear. But if you explore all the area, and then you're like, oh, well, now I've explored all the area, so... So... Are any of these multi-target? Nope. Where's my multi-targets? Oh, uh, let's see. Do I, wait, do I not have a... Do I not have a multi-target physical attack? Do I not have one of those? Double fangs, terror claw, giant slice, hysterical slap. No, I don't. Okay, screw it. I'll just... I'll just do that. Oh wow, they know summon. That's gonna be fun. Um Awesome. Alright. Uh You can just punch it. To death. We're over leveled for this area anyway, so I don't think we're gonna run into any problems. Actually, I think what I'm gonna do is uh Unless I encounter like a new shadow that I don't have. Joker, or something special. I think I'm just gonna skip ahead to uh, when I get to the first area with a... I'll skip ahead till... till um, I'll, I'll, I'll do this battle first. Mandrake! Never mind. We're gonna, we're gonna capture Mandrake here. So, Mandrake is weak to what? I don't know what they're... I don't know what Mandrake is. Mandrake's weak to not not ice. Okay. No, what's Mandrake weak to? Fine, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I'll just hit everything with ice and kill Mandrake. Okay, cool. Never mind. Got it. Good. All right. So never mind. Still don't have Mandrake. That's good. So yeah, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna skip ahead until, um, unless I get something like a persona, or a, uh, until I find the floor that the, uh, people are on, um, that's when I'll hop back in and be like, okay, we're back. So yeah, I'll say, ooh, actually, we, we found our way down, so, uh, yeah. Actually, I'll go down here, see if this is the right way to go. If the next area has a target in it, I'll just, I'll just stop. No, this p palace's security level doesn't seem to change, even if the enemies spot you. Mementos is different. While other places exist because of just one person, this one's from the public. From that perspective, it'd take more than a few intruders to make a mark on the security level. You'd have to do something so bad that the entire public sees you as an enemy. So, be careful, okay, Skull? Hey, shut up! I can sense our target somewhere in this area. Okay, never mind. Let's, uh, scour the floor for them. Actually, they seem to be right close. Right there, right, right here, close. So first target time. Mm -hmm. Want to head in? Yeah, let's head in. Oh, that's Taka. That's Taka Na Nashi's shadow, huh? This guy's bullying. This guy's bullying is real bad. From what I hear, it's mostly blackmail, taking money from people, that kind of thing. If we don't make him have a change of heart, his bullying won't get even worse. Let's go. Let's go. It's not my fault. It's theirs for not standing up for themselves. What was that? 
That's no reason. How is it their fault when you don't give them any choice, huh? You're the lowest of the low, bullying people weaker than you, knowing they can't fight back. <laughs> God damn it, this guy's voice actor. The hell? You're all ganging up on me too. Aren't you Phantom Thieves, some kind of gang? Protectors of justice, my ass. Don't act high and mighty with me when you don't know anything. Oh man, he's gonna turn into a thing. Oh, he's gonna turn into a Jack Frost. Okay. You're the one who doesn't know anything. Let's get him. I already told you, I didn't do anything wrong. Listen to me, damn it. No one's gonna listen to you. Not even being Atlas is... Oh, good, I'm afraid. I think that means I can't do anything. But I'm no, that's not going to stop me from trying. Nope, yeah, I can't do anything. Alright. Heavy damage. Augie Lab. Not even being Atlas's mascot is going to help you. Because this is Persona 5. I didn't have it short. So many goddamn delays. Anyways, but if you don't do it, then you're they're gonna hurt me. I don't want any I don't want people taking money from taking my money from me anymore. What? What are you talking about? If I don't go after him, I'm the one who's gonna get bu bullied. I can't take it, I just can't. Oh, I get it now. There's an even bigger bully. Ordering this guy around who's behind all this. Hey, didn't you just say it's people's own fault for not standing up for themselves? That's her. Please, help me. Alright. Thank you. Oh, thank you, you wonderful phantom thieves. This guy. Fickle fellow, isn't he? I'm counting on you. You guys promised. Yeah. Fine, but you better apologize to those people you bullied. Alright, we got a treasure. Alright, we got a protein. Another case solved. What's next? Do we keep exploring? Let's keep going. Right, I can keep at it. Alright, so now that we're done, I'm going to leave you guys until the next time we find a target. Huh? Those are... They're people, right? No. Well, I say they're mostly shadows. What are shadows doing here? It's not like they're going to be catching any train or... Stopped? What were you about to say, Ryuji? Oh. They got in. Come on, hey, man. where's that go? If I had to guess, I say into the deepest part of Mementos. What? This place seriously don't make any sense. Hey. Also, what's that on the platform? Is this... Isn't this a waiting room? I didn't expect there'd be one here, too. It looks like we'd be able to use this to take a break. Make sure to utilize it well, Joker. All hey. right. Here we go. But seriously, what's up with this place? Shadows ain't gonna attack us here? Mmm, it seems like this is some kind of safe zone separate from the other areas. Waiting rooms. You will occasionally find waiting rooms in Mementos. Just like safe rooms, you can quick travel and save your game from there. All right. Sweet. There we go. So, uh, yeah. Found a safe room. Um, that's why that's why I uh, came in. Um, I'll see you guys when I actually find another target. I can set a target somewhere in this area. All right, let's scout this floor and let's scout this floor for them. All right, so here we go. Target is going to be somewhere this way. Oh, wait, I should pick that up. I want that. Yeah, got the thing. All right. I'm sent to keep a low profile at school, but nobody talks to me in the first place. Oh, uh, well, want to go... I feel bad for cutting Ryuji off, but, uh... 
Oh, this looks fun. I mean, it's probably not a big deal. Yeah, so insta kills the thing. Also, these guys are pretty weak. There we go. Hmm, I can sense the target up ahead. Do you want to head in? Heck yeah. Oh. That must be Kazuya Mak Makigami's shadow. He looks so bad. Yes. He's part of a burglary ring targeting restaurants, and he's using he's used violence against his brother. We have to do something about this. Let's talk to him. <laughs> Me? I'm the one behind the burglary ring. Yeah, that's right. Am I the one behind the burglary ring? Yeah, that's right. I convinced my friends to do some part-time work for me, but I'm not in the wrong. Trying to make excuses now? You should be ashamed of yourself. No, I just mean it. I just meant it as a way to have a little fun, but those idiots got cocky. And now I'm the one who's in trouble. Damn it, why do bad things always happen to me? Huh? Bad things? What are you talking about? Yeah, ever since I was a kid, school, society, everyone treated me like I was dirt. My little brother was the smart one, mom and dad's favorite. They couldn't care less about me. How can you be expect me to live a normal life? I'm rebelling against this shitty society. You think you violence and crime is rebellion? Don't be stupid. I'll show you. What did you say? You guys, you guys are thieves too. Don't you think- don't think you're better than me, idiots. Go away. Aw, oh, man. Aw, oh, man. That looks serious. Such a condescending gaze. I'll crush you. Yay, he summoned my favorite enemies ever. Go down! Okay, that's not doing anything. What about Zio? No. Oh wait, he's paralyzed. No, my SP! I need that for things. Don't be a dick. Give me it back, actually. Hold on. I have an idea. Oh wait, that is a that is a multi-skill thing. <gasps> he even said for real. Oh, we don't get to take out the one guy. He was still alive. We should take him out. Oh, that was a lot of money I got from that. I'd like to try this skill soon. Speaking of money, what was I supposed to do? Just what are you Phantom Thieves anyway? This is impossible. I get it now. You must have heard from my brother. That's right. If you guessed as much, you must know how your brother really feels. He did this for me. That's the key to the chest in my room. Give it to my brother. You're supposed to be the good kind of thieves, right? What? Why would we do something like that for you? Psh. Anything you want from him? Anything you want to tell him? Well, <laughs> burn what's inside or throw it away, I guess. There it is. We got an old key. What are we gonna do about that treasure? We'll give it to his brother. Yeah, it's no use to us anyway. What will we do? I can give it to him since he goes to my school. No, I'll just sneak into his house. I think that's the best way. I hope everything resolves itself. In any case, we pretty much succeeded in our mission. Another case solved. What's next? Do we keep exploring? Let's keep going. And once again, I will see you guys back when we find the next floor with a target on it.
Actually, never mind. We're showing up right here. That's the girl. That's the shadow of the girl named Shim Shimizu. Uh, scary. She really seems like a sadist. She's calling someone her slave and ordering him around, right? I should have. In known. a way, she's denying his existence. I certainly wouldn't want to be a victim of that. Let's go talk to her. <laughs> so you're the pigs who wrote that calling card online? Why do I deserve this, hmm? <laughs> it's cause you made some guy your slave. That's all the ki that's all kinds of wrong there. That's what he wants. He worships me more than any god you know. Um... Uh, I don't know where to begin to explain how you're wrong. I beat him and I hurt him, and he sees it as a sign of our love and friendship. He's so happy. Hold him up. You're so delusional. Um, it's all about I'm pretty, and my grades are good. It's my right to order people around. I'll start by ordering you pigs. By giving orders to you pigs. Lick my shoes, peasants. But you're not wearing shoes. You're wearing your barefoot. You're going down. I'll never give up Emoto. He belongs to me. Being my happy sla being my slave is what makes him happy. Well, if that were true, he wouldn't have talked to us about it. That didn't work. That worked a little too well. All right. All right. Yeah, she resists physical, so that's probably not the best answer. Um, but it's not like you have a choice, because you're literally being forced to do that, so... Whatever. Alright, Ryuji. Let's do this. Alright. Now's our chance for... Oh, wait, we can ask her for things? Nah, let's do an all attack. I meant to hit triangle, I accidentally hit X. She's still alive. Crap. I thought I was gonna finish her. There we go. And we got a new skill too. Garula. Alright. Let's see what you don't need. Ah. You don't need Patra if you have Ma Patra. I guess you don't need Garu if you have... Well, nah, I don't want to get rid of that yet. That's where we're going. No, 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 no. I don't want to lose him. He's mine. He mi He's mine, isn't he? Keep this up and he'll hate you. I can never stand that. Why did you start treating him like that? <sighs> he just I kept doing? going along with it. So I misunderstood and thought I could do anything I wanted. Actually, I wanted to be more than friends with him. Huh? More than friends? You mean like as a boyfriend? Yes, I had a crush on him, but then I got possessive. Those feelings went out of control. Yeah. Be careful that you don't make things worse for yourself than they already are. Alright. Ah, the treasure has shown itself. We got a whip sword. That's a... Uh... Hey, on, guess what? We got you a new weapon. Nope. Nope. There you go. Enjoy. Alright, and there's a bear here. But once it opens up... Whoa, we did it! This is because more people believe in us now, right? That has to be it. Now then, let's get in there. Alright, let's go. And by let's go, I mean as long as this next area isn't a place where we, uh... Doesn't this look different from how it was before? Looks like there'll be an, it'll be a new area from here on. I'm starting to understand how this place works. Yes, it's quite a marvel to find the subway system down here. Uh, Eartha Yusuke, that's always been... It's always been like that. Alright, so this isn't, a, this isn't a floor with a target, so uh, see you guys when we get to the next floor with a target. The reason why I'm not, well, actually, I, I'll, let me explain. The reason why I'm not showing off Mementos is, I think I mentioned this before, but, um, shadow it's, identified. it's completely Awaiting random. There's nothing in there except for a shadow, so I'm not going to fight it. Um, 
Mementos is one of those there. It's like it's it's randomly ge generated, so it doesn't. Style while in the car. You think so? I don't believe the car is as bad as you say. It uh, it doesn't um. It's not the palaces aren't random, so like, the palaces will always look like. The palaces will always look like uh what they look like like there's never going to be a place in the palace where oh this hey how many floors are we on this how many areas are, are on this floor anyway the last floor had seven areas but the one before that had only two right i suppose it varies depending upon the location guess that means it ain't easy to tell how much of a floor we got left to cover huh that's right we won't know how many areas are on a floor until we make it to the end but judging by the vibe i'm getting from the shadows this floor isn't any smaller than the last um, but anyways, uh, since Mementos is random, it really doesn't, like, me showing you, oh, this is, th like, me showing you, oh, hey, look over here, this is a treasure. Like, that's not gonna happen when you play through the game. It's gonna be completely random. And unless something special happens in Mementos, it's literally just this, so. Once again, I, I don't want to show off all that, I don't want to, like, take up time in the episode. So, um, oh, actually, is this a rare one, or is this one we already have? It's one we already have, which means if we attack it and then we kill it, we get a bunch of stuff. Because those drop a good deal of money when they die. Well, the higher level ones do. I mean, 5,000 5, for one enemy is still pretty good. Also, you can break walls. Um, not all the walls. Um, if you notice, this wall was cracked and it had a lot of holes in it. And you could see through it. You can break those walls. Um, but anyways. Yeah, since, since, uh, since Mementos is random, I don't want to show it all off. So, once again, next time we get to a floor with a shadow on it, I'll, uh... When you go shopping for the job, do you end up I'll... buying unrelated stuff, too? Well, I guess candy and soda's still good for recovering. I'll, I'll see you guys next time we get to a floor with, with a shadow on it. With a target on it. I can send our target to somewhere in this area. Never mind. We're just just gonna be right here. Good. Oh no. They spotted us. No. No, no. 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 Let's not silence them. It doesn't matter. Oh crap. Dead end. Dead end. How did I get out of that? How did that happen? I'm in a car. How did I avoid them? I don't even know. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care how that worked. Oh god, not again. Not again. Not again. Ah! Huh. Alright, come on. Come on. Where's that target? Okay. Okay. Here we go. 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 I saw the target. I saw the target. Somewhere this way. Phew. Okay, we're good. I, it probably wouldn't have been too long to fight him, but uh, I want to get through this. That's not the door I wanted to open. That wasn't a door at all. Well, that was good. Oh no, now you're resistant to electricity. Whatever am I going to bad beat? Don't forget this feeling goal. Hmm, nice work, team. Alright. So I wanted to go into this door and then go through here. You wanna head in? Let's go. So we've taken out three targets, so we have three left. Okay. There it is. That should be the shadow of the man named Uchimura. Hmm? Doesn't he look like he's worried about something? But he's abusing his girlfriend, right? Oh man, didn't her fortune say she's gonna get seriously hurt? Huh? We can't let that come true. Let's hurry. I'll punch ya. This is horrible. Damn it, I gambled away all my money again. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Where is she? Get over here so I can beat you. Don't beat your girlfriend. What? Don't you dare lecture me. She's mine. I can do whatever I want with her. That's not true at all. 
Beating her is the right only I have. I'll have you know that she loves it too. If you want to get in my way, then you're gonna die. Alright. I'm gonna punch you too. Yeah, well, we're gonna punch you back, and that was a multi-target. I should not have done that. Also, we resist physical. That's good to know. I bet you don't resist psy uh, psy psychic attacks. Oh, he he does the opposite of resist psychic attacks. He is weak to psychic attacks. Well, this is gonna be easy. That was not Agilau. But I did inflict him with the burn, so that's good. Freyla. Oh man, technical. Oh hey. Makoto's dead. My bad. Don't worry, I'll 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 finish him off and then we can uh Then we can heal up. Why did it turn out like this? Because you're a dick. Also, that is a good sizable amount of money. Alright. Level up. Heck yeah, leveled up. I feel even stronger. My maximum HP and SP went up. This is horrible. I hate it. I hate it when people look at me like I'm just a bug to them. I can do better. I'm a superior human being. All the people around me just don't get it. Sleep stick times one. Phew, the right to beat his girlfriend? He really was the worst of the worst to think that. We changed his heart, so let's go tell that fort the fortune teller when we get the chance. All right. Look at all these people who li whose lives we're making better. Also Ryuji. Uh, well, that's that. Wh wh what now? You want to keep exploring? Let's keep going. Okay, I'm good too. All right, actually, Ryuji. Actually, let's heal up. We're gonna. We we all need healing. I need healing. On needs healing. Makoto definitely needs healing. There we go. That's looking a little better. All right. Also now, Ryuji, you got a sleep stick. There we go. Also, have I not upgraded Ryuji's weapon since? Uh, it doesn't matter. Anyways, see you guys when we get uh, back to the next floor with the target on it. I can sense our target somewhere in this area. Let's scour this floor for them. Oh, yeah. All right. Finally. I was wondering where their targets were going to be, because I was like, oh, hey, look. Target down this way. Hmm? Hmm? I can sense the target up ahead. Do you want to head in? Let's go. Those shadows must be the guardians of the student named Takase. Those two look pretty sure of themselves, real smug looking. So they're blackmailing that teacher, Kawakami, by using that incident where their child died. But Miss Kawakami did nothing wrong, right? We have to help her. Okay. Are you ready? Let's go. <laughs> money, money, money. Hurry and pay us your money. It's your responsibility. <laughs> Clothes, handbags, makeup. There's too many things I want. Hmm? You're Kawakami students? Did you come to bring me money? That incompetent teacher is so worthless. She should be grateful to be a source of income for me. You're incompetent, man. Sorry. Shut up. Kawakami got in my way. I was going to use what happened to my son to get back at people. I'm not gonna lose. I won't lose to elitists like you. All right, let's take these guys out. I don't like your attitude. I don't like your attitude. Take them down. It's right back at you. Oh man, he's weak to psychic. 
Is she also weak to Psychic? Okay, she's definitely not weak to Psychic. Is she weak to... Nukes? Nope. What about Fire? She's weak to Fire. Yeah, let's go. You, you picked the one with Zeo to do that. That's so dumb. That's so dumb. You know what else is dumb? That, that. The fact that I missed that is dumb. Alright, so... Varia Blast! Actually... Alright, it's my turn. Survive this! Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, we took you down. What do you have to say for yourselves? You're looking down on me, too? Deep down inside, you're laughing at me, aren't you? No, man, I just think that what you're doing is shitty. I wish this would Name stop. Brands. Aesthetic appointments, without them, people will laugh. No one's laughing. We're terrible human beings. Our son, Taiki, and his real parents were different. His parents were both high-level elites at big-name corporations, always looking at us coldly. That's why I left our son's... That's why I let our son experience what it's like to be forced to grovel. It felt nice to see him bra gradually break down from working so much. You're terrible human beings. I guess that's why everyone looked down on us. I'm not sure now if his birth parents really looked down on us. I was happy as long as it was with, as long as I was with Toshio, but I forgot all about it. I became obsessed with money. Taiki really was a good kid. Envy chain. All right. It seems that that it seems the Takase couple I ha had a change of heart. I should call Kawakami and meet her in my room. And let me just check real quick something. Hey. That one. Well, what should we do? Keep exploring? Let's keep going for now. Cause I don't know if we finished uh, requests. Nope. We have one more. One more request to do. So I'll see you guys when we find that. All right, we found it. There it is, Mogami's shadow. She's smirking. That's kind of creepy. Hmm. Her blog is full of all her crazy thoughts. She must be lost in some sort of sick romance fantasy. Shouldn't we do something about it before she can hurt anybody? Okay, let's go. Of course, let's do it. What's going on? What are you Phantom Thieves doing? I know you'd go after Kamishita, but why me? Hey, I don't blame you for all falling in love, but there's a point where it goes too far. You, you're the bitch trying to steal Ikisugi kun from away from me. What did you say? Who are you? Who are you calling a bitch? And I'm not interested in Ikisugi. Hmm, you're just a sore loser hanging out with some lame guys and a funny-looking animal. What was that? What did you say? Okay, that uh funny looking animal is she is she talking about me this makes me mad get her that is a disturbing shadow I completely forgot this was a thing uh, you you just die already I don't want to look at you that was not a lot of things okay that's gonna be fun uh, Freyla? Is that good? Kill it with fire, maybe? That might work. Nope. What about physical moves? Wow, she is tough. I'm not done. I actually have defense down. Go, go! 
Hey! That's a better version of the move I just used on you. That's not fair. But uh now the defense is down. Now we're now we're hitting her for something. Alright. Oh man, critical hit. Now's our chance. Oh dear. Oh no. Okay. Not good. Ow! I mean, don't beat up Makoto. There we go. Well, that was a good. That was a good decision. Oh God, Ryuji! Oh God, on! All right, you're going down. You're going down right now. There we go. Perfect. Nothing went wrong ever. Good. Level up. I feel even stronger. All right. All right, and Phoenix has learned a new skill. Oh man, now I have two people with recarm. And On has learned Diorama, which uh, hmm, more useful than actually more useful than Fire Break, because honestly, just, if something's resistant to fire, my romance, my passion, I can't believe it was all wrong. What is real love in romance? Shall I show you? You'll understand someday. Someday? When will that be? What should I do with all these feelings inside me? Just tell them face to face and don't write weird stuff in your blog. It'll take courage, though. Thank you. I'm scared, but I'll do it. Please, wait for me, Ikazugi-kun. Well... Hey, just don't do anything weird. There it is! The treasure! Sticky hairball. Yay. Gross. Um, now that we're here, this should open up. It opened. Don't you just feel like the whole world appro approves of you whenever these things open? For a second, but I think, but then I think how there's more of these walls waiting ahead. All right, let's get in there. Actually, let's not get in there because we're done. And actually, uh, let's... Let's go up to the entrance. And that's when... Let's do it. That's where I'm gonna save. Alright, so we finished all the requests for today. So I'm gonna call it here. Um... Yep. Gonna call it here. Alright. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Um, sorry, it's a little bit late. I realized that I was, uh, ordinarily I record these on the days before I upload them, but to, uh, last night I just wasn't feeling well, so I, uh, I decided to do it tonight. Um, so this is going to be a little bit late. Um, sorry about that. But anyways, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I will see you all in the next one. Peace out.